Toasted baguette rubbed with garlic topped with a tomato and fresh basil bruschetta, feta cheese, and grilled shrimp. Now here's a delightful dish. Yummy bruschetta with shrimp. This post started up here with me thinking about how to create a party snack. Then when we started working up the recipe, it was instant. This is more like a light lunch or perfect light meal idea. There are three components. We're gonna toast up some bread. We're then gonna toss up a very flavorful bruschetta topping. We've got some feta cheese on hand, and then we're gonna grill up some very delicious shrimp. It is super easy to make. Watch this. Let's prep the shrimp. I have two pounds of 1620s. The shell is already split down the back. They're also deveined, so all I need to do is peel away any shells and look for any lingering veiny bits. Once they're all peeled, we need a sharp knife. Cut them in half down the back. This butterflies them into two smaller tails. I know you're probably wondering, why did he just do that? Well, this is gonna be an eat with your hands kind of thing. If you leave the shrimps whole, it's gonna be way too unwieldy to eat. Let's continue now and make the bruschetta. Medium sized bowl, one and a half pounds of sweet little cherry or grape tomatoes. We're gonna cut them in half and then quarters. We're also gonna add a quarter of a sweet white onion, finely diced, two garlic cloves, minced, half a cup of fresh basil, thin strips, it's a chiffonade, and then a drizzle of extra virgin olive oil. Let's do a drizzle of balsamic, a little sprinkle of kosher salt and black pepper, toss everything together. Look at how delicious this looks. This has a ton of flavor. It comes together super quick, which we love. You can set your bruschetta to the side. Next up, let's work on the bread. I have one French baguette, it is cut in half, and then we're gonna cut those halves in half lengthwise. We're getting them ready for the griddle. So you're gonna need some extra virgin olive oil, pastry brush, plus a couple of cloves of garlic. Let's head to the griddle now. First, we're gonna toast up the bread, and then we're gonna cook up the shrimp. Today, everything's happening on my slate. It's a 30 inch rust resistant griddle from Weber Grills. We're gonna turn on the two left burners to moderate heat. That's 450 degrees Fahrenheit. Once the griddle is at temperature, we're gonna open the baguette halves, brush each one with extra virgin olive oil. Then over to the griddle, we're gonna toast the bread for four to five minutes. It's gonna be nice and golden. Then we're gonna take it off of the grill Rub the top surface with a clove of garlic. This gives this open face sandwich recipe lots of flavor. You can set your bread to the side. And now let's cook the shrimp. So next to the griddle, we're bringing out the shrimp plus a medium bowl, as well as half of a lemon, two garlic cloves minced, and some freshly chopped parsley. We also have foil at the ready. To cook the shrimp, a squeeze of neutral oil on the surface of the griddle, then add the shrimp, instant sizzle. You can just leave them be, let them sizzle and brown up. Then use your flipper, you can toss them around. You wanna make sure they're fully cooked. They gotta be pink. Now transfer the cooked shrimp to a bowl on the side. We're gonna sprinkle in the garlic. Let's give the bowl a squeeze of lemon juice. We're gonna do a hit of fresh parsley. You can toss the shrimp. Everything looks wonderful. Cover with foil. After that, everything comes back to the kitchen. Time to assemble, which I think is the best part. Cut each half of the toasted baguette into four. We're then gonna add a generous helping of bruschetta to the top of each. Then let's do a sprinkle of the crumbled feta. We're going to add two or three of the grilled shrimp halves and then do a little fresh herb on top. And just remember when you go to serve, you've got 16 portions. Place them out on a big plate or platter. Call everybody in. Instant great 
Lunch idea ready in no time. Full recipe is up at Weekend at the Cottage for you to reference. When you're visiting our website, please subscribe to it. Look for this video on our dedicated YouTube channel. You can subscribe to it as well. And then when a lunch is this fantastic, take a picture of it, post it on your favorite socials using hashtag Weekend at the Cottage on Pinterest, Instagram, and Facebook. It's our famous bruschetta with grilled shrimp. One bite and you'll know. Mmm, yes, so delicious. Bye.